Did you ever do Zyphaxin and Neomycin? Because that honestly was the only combination that gave me temporary relief. I did Zyphaxin. I can't remember if it was for one week or two weeks with, and I had no improvement in my SIBO. So I ended up asking, hey, can I do Zyphaxin and Neomycin? Because me, silly me on the internet was like, oh, well, how do I treat methane-based SIBO? I was the one that decided I had methane-based SIBO. Why? Because I had put myself into the box of being chronically constipated. Why? Because I had been using laxatives and feeling like I had needed them to go to the bathroom all the time. So I was like, oh, well, you use laxatives all the time. You're chronically constipated. You have methane-based SIBO. We need Zyphaxin and Neomycin. He gave it to me, and it actually ended up giving me some relief. Um, but that was the only way I had some relief with antibiotics was Zyphaxin and Neomycin together. Other than that, the only other relief I've had is from being on antimicrobials for almost two years now, which is blasphemy. No one should be on this stuff for this long. The course is really only supposed to be, I think, three months, like 12 weeks. But of course, I feel like I defy every normal case of taking something. They, like, I was on doxycycline. You were only supposed to be on for two weeks. They put me on for eight months. Like, I just feel like I am that person that never fits the traditional what you're supposed to do in the traditional medical world and it's always bizarre but oh, SIBO is such an annoying thing like can we just like I'm considering a fecal transplant at this point